Hi everyone. My name is Mark Everett and I'm a private practice plastic surgeon in New York City. I am truly honored to have been selected by Dr. Nahai to introduce my article to the readers as part of the Editor's Choice series. My manuscript is entitled Safest Practices for Autologous Buttock Augmentation with Fat Grafting Using a Roller Pump Injection Technique and can be found in the print and online editions of the July 2018 edition of the Aesthetic Surgery Journal. Buttock augmentation with fat grafting has been a perpetual hot topic for the last number of years and not always because of the beautiful results we have been able to achieve with this body contouring procedure. As desire for the procedure has skyrocketed, unfortunately so has the number of dreadful complications. This involves work done by both well-trained plastic surgeons and non-plastic surgeon practitioners. As news of complications started to become household discussion, it became clear that it was time for plastic surgeons with a history of safety and good outcomes to share their experience. In this manuscript, we describe a method of lipo injection that is safe and both time and cost saving. There are instructions in the article and a video online that instructs how to prepare the equipment and perform the procedure. And best of all is that there is little required in terms of specialized equipment. The learning curve is simple. And once you grasp this technique, you will spend less time in the operating room and thereby reducing the amount of time your patients spend under anesthesia. We also review pertinent anatomy and the safety measures that have been our standard of practice, which are inclusive of, but not limited to those recommendations published by last year's ASERF task force on this very topic. I believe that this article serves as an excellent primer for new surgeons trying to find a way that works for them or for experienced surgeons who may be interested in modifying their practice. I am proud to be part of a community that cooperates unconditionally in the name of safety. I hope that reading this article will help you introduce several advancements into your practice to help you achieve a refined result while simultaneously increasing the efficiency of your work and your awareness of some of the safety issues involved with this procedure. If you have any questions, please do not ever hesitate to contact me for further discussion. Thanks very much.